We've already seen Lance Armstrong in the centenary tour of 2003, doing a bit of cyclocross through a ploughed field to stay upright and in contention for his fifth consecutive victory. But there were other unexpected sights in that tour. Armstrong dehydrated and losing a minute 36 to Jan Ulrich in the tour's first long time trial, for example. He will keep his leader's yellow jersey, but he is yet again reminded he is in the toughest scrap of any Tour de France. And a top three separated by only 18 seconds, the tightest race that ever been. Armstrong was in the yellow jersey, but his lead over Ulrich was only seven seconds going into the last day in the Pyrenees. Not enough to cover him in the event of a repeat performance in the final long time trial on the eve of Paris. So, even as leader, it was up to him to attack and gain time. After some shadow boxing on the early calls, Armstrong, Ulrich and Ivan Mayo were together on the ascent to Luzardi Den, with a small group behind them. And the defending champion was setting the pace. And now it was Ivan... Oh, oh, what's, what's happened there? What has happened there? It seemed quite oh, a normal corner. He must have hit somebody in the audience. Mayo has gone. Now the situation. Remember the pair of sword when Ulrich crashed, Armstrong waited, but what? let's have a look at this now. It, I still is unclear here exactly what happened. What had happened was that Armstrong's brake lever had caught in the strap of a souvenir feed bag held by a young fan. Up ahead, Jan Ulrich had slowed, hostility suspended until the race leader got back in the race. It wasn't as simple as just getting back on his bike. Oh, oh, what is going on? There's a problem with his pedals. And this he has a problem happened. with his pedals. This is what happened. I think his pedal may have broken. This happened. He didn't hit anybody. Well, it I was the know. problem with his pedals. It was very strange to see that. He's looking down. He now knows he's got a serious problem. Watch this now. Well, he's this is awful. Digging deep and his foot has just come out. And he's... Oh, I don't oh, believe how he's managed to keep it up right there. Armstrong's tour looked like it had been undermined by a strip of fabric held by a fan and his inability to secure his cleat. In fact, the fall had given him a massive surge of adrenaline, and once he'd rejoined the group that had slowed for him, he got some use out of it. And after all of the problems of the day, Lance Armstrong is now trying to move clear of Iban Mayo, who also seems to recover from that fall. Lance Armstrong, at the moment, is really dancing on the pedals now. Well, look at this. On a day when Lance Armstrong could have lost the tour, he's going to win the stage now. As he punches the line, Lance Armstrong keeps yellow and increases his lead. Armstrong had extended his lead by 52 seconds after the most dramatic day's racing of the most dramatic tour for years. Scared the hell out of me.